Why is it when you go to the doctors with a problem with your chest or a problem with your stomach, the doctors often start by looking at your hands? Well, there's something called clubbing that can be indicative of many, many different diseases, which is why they get you to put your fingers together like so. Because here we're looking for that diamond shape between the two fingers as the nails touch. So this diamond shape that we've just seen with the fingers there is very important because this is termed Shamroth's window. And that might sound like a Lord of the Rings character that wasn't included in the movies, but it's incredibly important because it means the patient doesn't have a finger clubbing. But what's finger clubbing? This is swelling to the end of the fingers, meaning that the nail bows out, looking like it's very swollen, almost chicken drumstick styly. Now that's very important because it can indicate a large number of problems that could be going on in the body. There can be cardiac problems, respiratory problems, abdominal problems, thyroid problems. Oh, and every doctor's get out of jail free card, idiopathic. We don't know what's going on. So this is a really important, I've seen it, I'm probably going to have to work very hard hard here to pick up what's going on, but what are those conditions that can underline it? Causes of clubbing can be fibrosing alveolitis, lung abscess, empyema, bronchiectasis. We can have inflammatory bowel disease, so that's Crohn's and ulcerative colitis. We can have celiac disease. We can have issues with gastric lymphomas and viral problems, as I've said. There's such a broad range of things. Bacterial endocarditis, cyanotic heart diseases. This is a major sign because it says you've got to work hard for this patient, you've got to work out what's going on. Particularly if you're going to tell them that you think the sign is idiopathic, you need to be able to prove that. So that's a good starter for 10. What's going on with clubbing and can you work out whether or not that patient has something serious or not? Take care, I'll see you in the next one. Cheerio.